Hello and welcome back to this edition of Daily Actives brought to you by Bootleg Macro. I am Dustin and we are looking at Rivian today. And I'm actually really excited that this is back because if you watch any of my videos from the previous couple of weeks, I did talk about how I was really blown away that we're seeing EVs, multiple EVs. Like today we're going to be reviewing Rivian, Tesla, Neo, and Lucid. I am blown away by the EV moves here in the market because people are super into it. But if we look at what we have today, we are still and we have been since the end of June, three standard deviations above the mean. That's a crazy move. The volume has continued to increase and is also three standard deviations above its 23 day average of volume. And we've seen days where we've got um, a volume which is higher than the 10 day average two times in three days. That's a crazy kind of move. I don't know when this is going to really exhaust itself. Today might be that day, but I love what I see still. It was up 3.28%. It's up 53% in five days. If you don't know what that means, I mean, you really need to be careful with your money in the stock market. Um, if it's going to be 15 days, it's up 67%. One month, 81%. And three months, it's 80%. So you really want to just pay attention to the fact that things have really changed here. The one thing that's very confirming, though, is that you do have a rolling positive on the six month, which it looks like that's the first time for the entire year. So you do really want to believe that. Obviously, you've got to go along, go along, go along, bullish, bullish, bullish and no confusion here, you're gonna be at the extreme levels of this. I do wanna take a look at the chart just to give you a representation. This thing essentially was down around what, $13, now you're up at 25, so you have gone up 100%. The volume's crazy, but it looks like it's falling. The volatility is very high, but I don't expect it to necessarily break out completely. If we look at the price correlation and the volatility, they're rising together, so you will expect very jagged moves. When that correlation and that volatility turns, it will be very ugly. You can see the correlation or the volatility breaking out here in the size of the range. Obviously, this is still way above the range. This is three standard deviations and been essentially redlining for about a week and a half now. We can see the ultra-fast sentiment. It looks like we are up at, what is that, 65.9%. This generally gets up to around 60 and then falls, so being at 69% is a lot. But tell me what you think in the comments below. Are you long? Are you short? Do you like it? Do you love it? Is this even a good review? And don't forget to subscribe to the News High newsletter, which you can subscribe for at bootlegmacro.beehive.com slash subscribe. Talk to you soon.